I had put my robot on YouTube, I just put a video out there of and sharing some of my files and my design, and it just took off. That's kind of how it started, and I've uh, just had a huge response and a ton of people that are really interested in, in building this robot. I sat down with Chris in his studio and asked him about the various applications he has seen for his AR4 robot. All of it's been pretty surprising to see what people have come up with. Um, I've seen, uh, you know, people are using it for welding. There's quite a few different welding applications I've seen. I, I had somebody send me a video of them. They had put the robot inside of a plexiglass box with an ice cream dispenser and they had programmed the robot to uh, grab an ice cream cone and fill an ice cream cone and, and hand it to people. Machine tending, I've uh, seen quite a few applications for people using it to tend CNC machines. I've got a friend in California who uh, we actually became friends through our correspondence on, on the robot and, uh, and he built the robot and, and has it tending a CNC machine, taking parts off of his machine. So that's, you know, and he posted some videos of that so that, you know, it's gotten a lot of uh, activity in that community. I've seen a lot of applications for people using the robot for cinematography. A lot of people love to put, uh, use the robot for motion control, for putting the camera on there and getting slow motion shots around whatever it is that they're recording. The biggest thing has is, is been really cool to see is schools using it. I've had hundreds of colleges, universities, they're using this yearly now in their curriculum. A lot of professors have told me they like about it is that they can teach mechanical design, assembly, additive manufacturing with 3D printing, some of the 3D printed parts that are for the robot, as well as electrical wiring, and then all the programming, you know, all the, the software is all open source, so that gives them an opportunity. So it's kind of an all-in-one package. They can teach all these things with it. I've been really surprised. I haven't, never would have thought half the things people have done with it that I'd see, but, you know, the project's really taken off. If you would like to support Chris and learn more about the AR4 robot, visit anonrobotics.com.